Live from Los Angeles, welcome back to Good Morning La La Land. It's an absolute honor to welcome B. Howard to the show. He's a multi-platinum award-winning producer, recording artist, and wild talent. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for <laughs> being with so us much. this morning. Glad mm -hmm. to be here. We're so excited to share your light. I met you the other day, and I thought, wow, there is just this energy that radiates off you. Oh, wow. <laughs> You're such a star, right? <laughs> I appreciate it. So tell us a little bit about your past. You've been involved for music from a very, very young age. Yeah, yeah. So um, they used to call me like a child prodigy, per se. Like, I started making music for like guys like um, R&B guys, like, you know, Ginny Wine and Drew Hill and these other types, going to Amarion, to Jason Derulo, to Neos and Vanessa Hudgens and so forth. Mm. So it's been a, a pretty wild ride coming up. Mm. Like, And you grew up around the Jacksons, right? I mean, you, yeah. you know, I mean, you do look a lot like Michael Jackson. I'm sure you get this all the time. <laughs> yeah, like, Every now and again. Yeah. He's come back. <laughs> Genesis, it's all over again, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, a lot of that, you know, we came up and a lot of that is like my home training and stuff with my mother singing and all of my family being performers and stuff. It's easy to to learn without learning. It's like, you ever go to hear people going to music school and stuff like that? Like, I never used to credit mm -hmm. them for, you know, my work and my talent, but honestly, as I think back on it, it's like, it's an automatic music school. It's like the best of the best at their time. Just You're just soaking it in as you're just playing. So do you ever channel? Like, I have art, I have spiritual artist friends, and they literally say they're, that Michael Jackson comes to them. Wow, really? And I'm like, <laughs> I swear, and I'm like, okay, so obviously as a big spirit, does he ever come to you? Do you ever feel like his presence coming through your art at all? Among other people, I, I, I don't really channel. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> What I do believe and what my mother and everyone says is that uh, he and a lot of others come and they're like with me during my journey, you know, other people that are like Gerald LaVert and, you know, other people that have passed or whatnot that I've known and that have been very close to me, they come and they protect me. That's what they yes. say. I was like, I'm just like, okay, thank you. <laughs> and every now and again, I feel like there's somebody there, like always playing jokes or something. <laughs> Yeah. You even in 2018 portrayed Michael Jackson in a lifetime of two yeah, cars. Yeah. What was that like for you? It was weird. <laughs> yeah. You know, Corey, um, Corey Feldman, you know, I've known him since I was a kid. He's it, 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 <laughs> Howard laughing at me. Right Howard. <laughs> Mickey Howard is your relative. Yeah. The legendary Mickey Howard. Yeah. That's your That's mom. His mom. Man, Mickey, Mickey, how was yeah. he bad? Bro. And and he's part of that family too. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Which family? Jackson. The Jackson family. Yeah, man. So that's true. Corey, it's your interview. Yeah. Yeah. Corey brought you up in his interview, B. Because, I mean, because let me tell you why. Not because of that. Uh huh. Because he is going to be on the new Latoya Jackson show, right? I can say that, yeah. right? Yeah. Okay. And the reason why the the family is now letting it be known that he is family is because. This guy is so talented, you can't keep him down. Mm -hmm. There's nothing that's going to keep him quiet. He's going to roar like a Ryan. Well, that's interesting to know because I remember reading about that, and they said that this there was this kid who was um, the son of Michael Jackson. Latoya is going to bring it to the surface. They said Be that? Who said that, that? that? That's what a lot of people Not you. Okay. Well, okay, yeah, 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 okay, yeah. No, yeah. No, no, but, no. I mean, that's good, bro. That's that's, a, some that's some between him and, and Latoya and all those people, though. you got to respect that boundary, you know. Because you look like him. Um, Corey Feldman, you know, I've known him since I was a kid. He's kind of like a godfather almost. Mm. And it was like, um, he, he felt that because of our relationship and stuff like that, and he felt it was the best, you know, the thing for, for me to play that because we had no personal behind the camera, mm -hmm. you know, different. And I was like, okay, I did it for him, and I did it to try to do something the right way. You know, because, you know, some people portray him like, you know, different you know and it's not like it's so different as the image but it's not who he was mm. who was he to you oh he was cool as hell <laughs> <laughs> no like i mean like you grow up and, and you see everything like people are who they are and it's like sometimes you have to protect yourself and i feel you know crazy that you know people have some opinions you know Mm. the way they have them but uh, through my music and through what I'm doing through what I represent and I don't have to be boxed in the way he does and my mom was like he wanted to have what you have as far as your, your freedom and in my image and controlling it the other way I do and I'm really like lucky about that Aww. so what do you I want I honor that. <laughs> and you will 
Absolutely. Mm -hmm. What do you want your legacy to be? With the freedom to decide. Like I want my legacy to be exactly what I'm I'm going. I want to walk my path and and just like maybe somebody look back and see I did some things right and I, the things I did wrong. You know, I think some things that I've done wrong early on was I was very afraid of who I was. I was yeah. very afraid of what I meant to people, you know, and what I represent. And it's because it's a heavy thing. It's a heavy thing to go around and people crying for you all the time. And, you know, and that kind of feeling of what your responsibility has to be. No one wants to have that responsibility of having to always do the, you know, the yeah. straight and narrow. But, you know, I, I relax, have mm -hmm. fun. I have a great upbringing and I, I'm confident I'm not going to make those kind of things. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. no. I think there is, there, there's like a, as we advance and we have, we're given more mm -hmm. in this universe, we have more responsibility with mm -hmm. that for sure. And some people, you know, take that and, and bring grace back to the world and some others kind of, you know, misuse it. Mm -hmm. And it's beautiful to watch you in blooming and finding your way and living your truth. So thank you so much for all of the art and love that you're bringing to the world. Wow, so thank everybody. you. That's the first. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's really nice. Oh. <laughs> that's so sweet. Do you plan to release more music in the U.S. soon? Absolutely. Um, there's a song that's, uh, that was just recently released, um, Night and Day 3.0. And I was really surprised. Like that song, like it was got me a Best New Artist Award. I was like, wow. Love cool. that song. Right. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So that's the song that, uh, that I'm currently right. releasing. And then there's another one called Loud and Loose Control. There's so many so mm. different songs that I've created. And actually, I'll be working with uh, Molly Maul, um, uh, J-Lack, Usher's Brothers, amazing. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Right now. Oh, yeah. yeah. So we, we know that you're also having a new manager. Oh, yeah. So your career is really kind of projecting and taking a new direction. Yeah. What's next for you? Magazine covers, working, you know, the next level. Like a lot of things are basic things and the big things I've got done. But I'm, having a manager helps you set all the foundation in place. Mm -hmm. You know, new management makes a, a big difference. Yeah, absolutely. Well, if there's an intuitive factor in me, I say you're already huge, but watch out. I just have oh, to you. <laughs> I'm working. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Working. Just quantum leave level that. Yeah, yeah so absolutely. keep it up. Let's Thank you so much. Keep us dancing because that's yeah. what we need in our lives. Where can mm -hmm. everyone find and follow your journey? Um, you can find me at right, behowardofficial.com, Instagram.com slash behowardofficial. I hope to see you guys there. Hashtag be hard. <laughs> Thank you guys for having me here. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Yeah. Thank Thank you.